This is truly a great country in which we live. We have so many opportunities to make a difference for our families, for our communities, for the states that we serve, and for the world in which we live. I love this great city. I love the people who are a part of the history and is the present of this great city. Without question, Senator Luger is the type of lawmaker and leader who works hard to bring both parties together, find common ground, and pass needed legislation. It's also one of the premier virtues of Dick Luger is, is how he conducted himself as a United States Senator. Um, always knowing that uh, the image of a senator was important and it uh, really was about honesty and integrity in doing the job as the American people would want all their public servants to do the job. This was one of the great Hoosier leaders of the last 50 years and one of the most brilliant uh, statesmen on American foreign policy. He was a patriot, a great husband, a great father, a great family man, a business leader, and he had a, 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 an unusual ability to bring people together. And he knew that if you spend time building relationships, you could find common ground with, with almost anyone. He believed in bipartisanship. Uh, he believed in working with people and respecting the rules. He had a great vision uh, for our country and for the world. And, and you know, there's an old saying, LaGuardia said once that, you know, there's not a Democrat or a Republican way of cleaning the streets. Dick Luger believed that there wasn't a Republican or Democrat way of conducting American foreign policy. I think uh, drawing on the, the memory of people like Richard Lugar, I think that uh, we can hope that in the future this sense of uh, both bipartisanship and a sense of international responsibility will be restored uh, to the Senate of the United States here in Washington. To be in Senator Lugar's path was life-changing. We all started off impressed by his giant intellect and commitment to public service. And then we were rolled over by his kindness, his decency, his commitment to all of us. The kinds of things he did were because of the kind of person he was. Today, we rededicate ourselves to those lessons and values we learned from him, and our hearts are grateful. He believed, as I believe, that the world is a better place because of U.S. leadership. I think he was the kind of person the country needs in its leadership, not just during the years when he led the efforts, but even today. Now, a lot of people will tell you that compromise is the same thing as uh, aiming low. But uh, Senator Luger told us something different, that real and lasting change, sustainable change, happens not through division, but through unity, by building bridges and by seeking shared understanding. And it was my privilege, uh, among many other of you, to be able to work with this special man who understood the importance of bipartisanship, the importance of keeping your word, and the importance of uh, respecting the Constitution and the need of our country to come together. Uh, we miss him enormously. I would say that the best advice that I received is to be honest, maintain your integrity, tell the truth. That is difficult advice to follow under all circumstances, but very good advice.